And Miami police have some new tools in their arsenal. The department's chief announcing the addition of two new speedboats to their fleet. The 25-foot contenders will help with law enforcement on shallow waters where accidents happen. We definitely need these. CBS 4's Maribel Rodriguez was there as the chief showed off the boats earlier today. The city of Miami police taking to the waters, unveiling their latest addition to the department. Today I'm very proud to announce that the city of Miami has been able to procure two shallow draft uh, boats in order to provide better public safety um, on the waterways. Although the police department does have rescue boats for larger and deeper bodies of water, these two 25-foot contender vessels are specifically designed for shallow waters like Blue Lagoon near Miami International Airport, a very popular spot for small boats, skiers, and personal watercraft enthusiasts. This is the first time um, in the recent history of the Miami Police Department that we've had uh, this equipment to be able to uh, patrol areas that are shallow. The new boats will mean a higher level of security for all who enjoy water sports in the area. Unfortunately, in Blue Lagoon, there have been a number of personal watercraft accidents and deaths. Last year, 32-year-old Manuel Aponte was tossed off his personal watercraft and went missing. Rescue crews searched for days. Sadly, his body was later recovered. The chief of police now saying these two new boats will allow them to respond much faster and save lives. Before, we would have to count on our other uh, law enforcement partners to bring us equipment to be able to conduct rescue operations or enforcement operations. Now we can um, have enforcement and rescue operations um, with our own equipment and the response time will be much quicker. And not only will the city of Miami police be using these boats in rescue operations, they will also be here specifically on the weekends when it is very busy here in Blue Lagoon to make sure that everyone is safe. In Miami, Maribel Rodriguez, CBS 4 News.